Do run, 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 do run, run. My best friend, his name is Pete. Do run, 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 do run, run. He had the largest feet. Do run, 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 do run, run. Yeah, yeah. He was incredibly neat. Yeah, yeah. Let's turn up the heat. Yeah, yeah. He liked to dance in the street. Do run, 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 do run, run.
problem that a repairman can fix? Leaky pipes. Leaky pipes. Leaky pipes is the scene. Are you ready? Yes. Begin. <laughs> I see some wetness here, Sarah. It's looking kind of wet. I told you to talk to me like a lady from now on, Chuck. Oh! Okay. I see what we're talking about. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that's real good. Do you feel that? Do you hear that? I do. Hold on. Hey, what's going on? I see you got a leaky pipe. I'm here to fix it. <laughs> I can see that. <laughs> By your name tag, your name must be Bob. Yeah, it's Bob, short for Robert. Got a problem with that? Tell me about my supervisor. Okay. Hi, Bob. I like the way you just kind of took control of Chuck there. Well, you, we see. That's what we prepare to do. Just gotta take control of that leaky pipe, and then you just shake it up until it dries up. You hear that, Chuck? That's a real man talking. Yeah, you see that? She wants a real man. <laughs> Chuck. I've right. been telling you I, that forever. I have no hips, just no <laughs> ones whatsoever. But that belt is really slimming. Oh, thank you. Anyway, we're going to fix this pipe right now. I'm going to need to know where your water system is. <laughs> water system, you know, we're on the water. Like, like the, your heat. That, you know what? I'm just going to pull this. Oh. That one. I'm going to pull time. Now. We need to replay the scene according to another theatrical genre. Musical. A musical. <laughs> Will you look at this mess? What did I tell you about talking to me like that? Over and over and over, you talk down to me. There's a mess here on the floor. Oh, a real mess. I see. A real mess. A real mess.
Sarah. Yeah, Chuck. I think our roof is leaking. What did I tell you about talking to me like that, Chuck? I'll shoot you right between the eyeballs. Whoa, that's a lot of talk coming from someone who wanted to run in heels. Uh, all right. Chuck, There's... don't talk to me like that with guns in both my hands. I understand, Sarah. You're a little upset. I'm just saying there's nice. There's just some water here. Oh my God. I think that's the repair cowboy man. Cowboy Bob, I know. I reckon you got yourselves a problem here in your watering hole. We sure do. Get out of my way, partner. Just because he has furs that are four inches long don't make him a man. It's not just his furs, it's the champs. <laughs> okay, you got that. You got that. <laughs> all right, all right, partner. I just want you all to stay calm, and I want you to tell me where the damn varmint is being held in the cabin. Well, we don't know, Bob. That's why we have you, someone to come and help us, because we don't know nothing. We're just hicks. Well, I reckon if I go over here... Whoa. That's what you can Nice job! Now, ladies and gentlemen, the crime has been committed. There has been a crime. A crime so vicious, so insidious, that it's a... I can't even say it. Yeah, but we do know for sure who the criminal is. It is! Alleged! Becky Mars! Alleged! Allegedly! No, not allegedly. That's that's just. Oh, I don't even want to talk about it. It's horrible. Did you do it? Did you do it? Uh-uh. <laughs> we'll get it out of her yet. Nope. It's time for interrogation. Rick! Ryan! Kirk! Interrogators! Come on out here. Here's what we're gonna do. We're going to need to get her out of here. And we, with the help of the audience, are going to interrogate her and find out exactly what the crime hey, was. Hey, you, you know what? I'm going to stick around for this. Oh, 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 hey, hold somebody on. Somebody help me. Hold on. We, we need somebody from the audience. She's ready to leave. We need somebody to right there, escort her. Oh, 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 have a hand. Oh, yeah. Yeah. What? He knows my medicine. <laughs> okay. We gotta wait until she's out of earshot. She can't hear any of this. We've got some planning to do. Us. Here's what we're gonna do. There's a crime that's gonna been committed. And we need to find out from you what is that crime? What's the unusual crime? Something you wouldn't see on the front of the Valley News, something like elephant napping, or, or uh, taking, uh, taking three pigs from the local uh, PNC store. What, what? Okay, I gotta shout it out. What is the insidious crime? Someone broke the pencil sharpener. Someone broke the pencil sharpener. Oh, oh that's bad. Okay. And exactly what did she use to break the pencil sharpener that you wouldn't expect that you would use to break a pencil sharpener? Something really weird. A toothbrush! I heard it. She broke a pencil sharpener with a toothbrush. And exactly where did this crime happen that you would not expect to find either a toothbrush or a pencil sharpener? In a what booth? In a confessional. Ah. Okay, so here's the deal, gang. She's going to come back, and she's going to be interrogated by these three fine detectives. And they're going to get her to say that she broke a pencil sharpener using a toothbrush while in a confessional. 
And they're going to do this without ever mentioning the words pencil sharpener, toothbrush, or confessional. Can they do it? Let's find out. Bring in that criminal. Bring in that criminal. Somebody run outside. Bring that. Get that criminal. They're in this. Oh, that's it. We got to do clapping. Let's get them back in. Well, that really must be a soundproof chamber you got. That is a very right? soundproof chamber. You're not delighted that. That's not the skate. Makes me want to throw up. Throw up. <laughs> well, if you quit sticking your finger down your throat, maybe you wouldn't throw up all the time. Oh, it's not <laughs> sticking fingers into throats, that's a problem. Yeah, it's just sticking something into something else. Hey! <laughs> I should hope not, because I'm a good girl. Right. Now I'll poke you in the eye, you tell me that again. Poke <laughs> that officer. I'll uh, put them up your nose. Oh, will you? Mm hmm. Why don't you think about all the school children you're disappointing? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Haley, am I a disappointment? They can't get their work done. Scumbags like you. Hey. Don't you know about the graphite shortage? Hey, hey, I like chewing on pencils. Oh, really? Yes, but not those new ones. Those new ones that are kind of plasticky? No, no, no. Give me a good number two with a wooden thing with a nice graphite set. Yeah. What are you, dull? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's how you take care of pencils, huh? I've sharpened a few in my life. Uh-huh. Not in the traditional way, huh? No, but you know, they didn't, I didn't grow up being called Beaver for nothing. <laughs> <laughs> Go get some coffee for the boys. What? 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 Don't look at me. What are you doing here? Hey, Gopher! How are you? Yeah, like the. I like. You got your braces off. Yeah, he's very into oral hygiene. Yeah, well, he taught me everything I know about the sharpening pencils with my two front teeth and then flossing. <laughs> Tell that to the priest. <laughs> Bless me, Father. Hey, lady. <laughs> I was just speaking to you. I'd say speak to the devil, but you know. Hey. <laughs> in the chapel today, do you, do you hear me about that? Yes, Bruce. And you were there, and a lot of uh, things happened that I'd rather not talk about. I'm not confessing again. Mm -hmm. Yeah? I mean, you know, in my the, father. In the, in the room. <laughs> the room. In the vestry. <laughs> you, you've known me for a long time, father. And, um, what, yes? Oh, no, ignore me. Yeah, okay. Yes. <laughs> very bad. Uh, does anyone have anything to help with her oral hygiene? I ate a whole clove of garlic. Just recently. I just... Hello. Excuse me. Stop. I just wanted to give you this paperwork uh, for... Oh, her again. 
I, see, I know her. She, it's not her first brush with the law. See that gleam in her eye, I'll tell you. This is my purple toothbrush. Too late, it's already on record. See? Dang it. <laughs> Dang it. Purple is my downfall. Exactly. And so is he gonna be. He's wearing purple out of purple. Uh, this trip. Yes, come in. No. Excuse me, Father. Yes? Oh. Yes, I'm gonna have you. Oh, I think I've sinned again. It's in your hand. And but I can't believe you would use it. Stand me the convention, eh? <laughs> She's here! Doing that crime that she was doing before? <laughs> I'm telling you, she's not a sharp one. She's a bit bristly. She's a, she's a bit bristly. My electric toothbrush is not in its charger. And now it it won't vibrate. <laughs> hey. So what do you think? Still putting it in that other thing would make it work? Hmm? Well, sometimes when you put it in the collection plate at church, it's you know, okay. Well, I admit there are some orphans out there with that, but that's not Look, uh, look, I'm sorry, I like oral hygiene. You go around brushing people's teeth. I mean, come on. Yeah? yeah. How do you explain what? your chewing those uh, things before? Pencils? Yeah? Oh, yeah, no, I didn't. What'd you do to them? Oh. Yeah, what were you doing? Well, I was chewing them. Yeah? yeah. And, and what were you doing to them? What you... Making them kind of what? Soggy? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I, 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 excuse me, officer. That's my mom. Oh. Mom, everything's wrecked at school. You got me all those wonderful things to write with, and I can't use them. Anymore. You look good for your age. Hey, how can you kids all of you up? It doesn't make any sense. Listen, I got a man from China. Okay. <laughs> so tell us what your crime is. Well, you know. <laughs> Mom is busted. We got to lean on her. <laughs> okay, look. My number twos are dull. Okay, look. I started a Ponzi scheme with number two pencils. I was going to replace them with my vibrating toothbrush, but then I realized I had really bad breath and I needed to floss. So I took the toothpick. I took the tooth. Uh, I, I, no, wait a minute. I, I took the pencils to toothpick with, and then you know I started poking all the kids with them because it was really fun. And, and, and where did this happen? Seminary Hill School. <laughs> Seminary? Yeah, you were there. We yeah. know that. The priest wasn't too happy about that. Okay. Mm -hmm. When you yeah. told him. Yeah. In the little box. <laughs> the confessional? Yeah. 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 I'm uh, here to pick up the recycling and holy smokes, look at all those metal things. Is there one of these left on the wall anywhere in this building? No, nope, the they're all cracked, are all they're all down. broken. Holy smokes. Okay, well, I'll take them with you. Take, take, get rid of them. No, wait, I always take them. one because I like to empty them and watch all that dust come out. <laughs> now, you see, you robbed your child of, your, of his only Hey, party. hey, hey, my child is allergic to frankincense. I did him a favor by taking all of those incense burners away. Let me, let me see that pencil sharpener. It's that gleaming silver. I love it. I love it. I can see it. Okay, that's... Becky! Step up here. Yeah, sorry. I don't want to. Do you know what your heinous crime is? Moment of truth. Yeah. What? A legend. Yeah. Uh, I uh, took a whole classroom of 
fifth graders at Seminary Hill hostage with <coughs> some number two pencils and a pencil sharpener that was on the wall that I tore down with my electric toothbrush because I thought everybody had some really bad breath and so I had to brush everybody's teeth but I needed to sharpen them because everybody wanted to be vampire for <laughs> new New Moon Saga and then So you pulled what? The incense burners. <laughs> Yeah, I know what it is. I, 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 I knew that. Goodness oh, gracious. Oh. And what did you use to break the pencil sharp? A toothbrush. Yeah! yeah. And where did this heinous crime take place? Our holy roller rosary church of God. <laughs> what church? What, 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 what specific room? He, uh... <laughs> Confessional! Yeah. Well, after that, I think we need some real help, and we have someone here that's going to tell us all about how to get a lot of help. Well, Rachel! Guys, our next game is about, it's called Superheroes. What I'm going to need from everybody first off is a mundane problem that could become an emergency, but wouldn't typically be an emergency. Dad! Dad? 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 Superheroes, I need your help. We're, but I don't want normal, run of the mill, like Captain Wonderful or whatever. I need, I'm gonna give you the beginning or the end of the superhero's name and I need you to fill in the rest. So, Captain Wonderful! I have your Captain Body Odor and I like that. How about the boy? The boy Narcoleptic! The boy Narcoleptic! Oh, 
It's okay. I'm, I'm far enough away. The tantrum, the tantrum's not good enough for that meal. All right. Well, you look like you're doing well, so yeah. I'm off now. Awesome. Hey, buddy. Hey, you. Oh, Rick, your dandruff is getting all over me. Gosh, sorry. I don't know what I'm doing. I mean, I do all kinds of things every day, but I can't this figure out. This looks like a job for narcolepsy boy. <laughs> Hi, narcolepsy boy. Hi there, and with my powers of being, putting people to sleep with my very words, I will take care of you because we found that dandruff is caused by hyperactivity. So all I need to do is put you into a stupor for a little bit, and your dandruff will be gone. Hmm, let's see what would work. How about the best speeches of Ron Paul? <laughs> I think that we should stay back at home and cut back on defense and a uh, little bit left. Another Obama economic policy. Uh, throw money, throw money, throw money, throw money, <laughs> and wake up! Oh, 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 don't touch me! Oh. Wake up! It's gone! Your service is My work here is done. No time for another job for not collecting <laughs> Old Factory Premonition Boy! 